Hey everyone, it's Andreas here and you are watching Crazy Controller. Here is a quick daily news update on the upcoming Nintendo Switch. Today we are talking about the reveal of install file sizes of 7 upcoming Nintendo Switch games. This reveal was on the Nintendo Japanese website and the image you are currently seeing on the screen is thanks to Pixel Pa. You can find the source and Twitter link in the description below. As mentioned before, the Nintendo Japanese website has been updated with file sizes for various number of upcoming Switch games. Now this helps us to understand if we should go all digital or maybe buy the physical cards from a retail shop. So thanks to this list we can see that Puro Puto Tetris is 1.09 gigabytes. I am Setsuna is 1.4 gigabytes. Cinepaclips is 1.6 gigabytes. Super Bomberman is 4 gigabytes. Ambition Sphere of Influence with Power Up Kit is 5 gigabytes. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe is 7 gigabytes. Dragon Quest Heroes 1 and 2 is a massive 32 gigabytes. And the highly anticipated game for the Nintendo Switch, The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild is 13.4 gigabytes. Now these sizes are based on the Japanese versions of the games, but we can probably safely say that the English versions will be similar, if not even the same sizes. So we can see some games will be small in size and massive in size as well, like the ones like Dragon Quest but you're most likely looking at an average of 8 to 10 gigabytes for each game. Now this, of course, will vary with the game, but that is just an average. So this may mean that if you want to go all digital, you will need to upgrade your micro SD card to something like 256 gigabytes and higher. Remember, the Nintendo Switch can support up to 2 terabytes in storage. The system alone comes with only 32 gigabytes, so it may be wise to upgrade to a bigger micro SD as we still don't know anything regarding to the system memory or even things like virtual console on the Nintendo Switch. So let me know in the comments below what you are planning to do. Will you be getting a bigger SD card and going all digital purchases or are you planning to just buy the physical cards at the shop? Thanks for watching this video, remember to like and subscribe and remember to check back on Crazy Controller for most coverage and videos on the Nintendo Switch and until next time, keep playing games.